we now discuss the solution of a problem from the section coordinate geometry and uh, this this question has appeared in the joint entrance examination main held on 28th june 2022 in the second shift this problem is related to the concepts of straight lines the given question is let a triangle be bounded by the lines l1 given by 2x plus 5y is equal to 10 l2 given by minus 4x plus 3y is equal to 12 and the line l3 which passes through the point p 2 comma 3 intersects l2 at a and l1 at b if the point p divides the line segment ab internally in the ratio 1 is to 3 then the area of the triangle is equal to we are given four options these are the four options option a b c and d it is given a triangle is formed by three lines l1 whose equation is here l2 whose equation is here and the line l3 the question of l3 is not given but conditions are given for l3 and it says l3 passes through the point p with coordinates 2 comma 3 l3 intersects l2 at a l3 intersects l1 at b now it is given that the point p 2 comma 3 divides the line segment ab the line segment ab internally in the ratio 1 is to 3 then required to find the area of the triangle abc let's now discuss the solution of the problem in detail given the lines l1 whose equation is 2x plus 5y is equal to 10 l2 whose equation is minus 4x plus 3y is equal to 12 let's see the diagram this is our l1 this is our l2 and let c be the point of intersection of these two lines l1 and l2 this is the point of intersection this is the point c let us say now to find the coordinates of the point c we have to solve the equations of l1 and l2 for x and y now solving the equations the first equation 2x plus y y is equal to 10 and the second equation minus 4x plus 3y is equal to 12 solving we get the coordinates of c they are given by minus 15 by 13 comma 32 by 13 and we have to solve two equations two unknowns and uh, we are very familiar how to solve these equations it is left to you i have not shown the method now see the coordinates is minus 15 by 13 comma 22 by 13 given there is a line l3 it is given that this passes through the point p 2 comma 3 this is l3 passing through p 2 comma 3 agreed and uh, this l3 intersects l2 at a and l1 at b right so l3 intersects l2 at a 
L1 at B. Thus we have formed the triangle ABC whose area is required to find. To find the area of ABC, the coordinates of C are known. Now, we have to find the coordinates of A and B. If you know the coordinates of the vertices of the triangle ABC, we can very easily find out the area of the triangle ABC. Right, that's what we have done so far. That's the diagram what we have. Now, let us, let us say the coordinates of A and the A lies on L2, lies on L2. Therefore, if the x coordinate of A is alpha, because it lies on L2, take the line L2 and substitute for x the alpha. Then you will get 3y is equal to 12 plus 4 alpha and y is equal to 12 plus 4 alpha by 3. That is the ordinate. So, because A lies on L2, it will be like this. And because B lies on L1, let the x coordinate be beta, get into L1. So, for x you substitute beta, then you will get 5y is equal to 10 minus 2 beta and beta will be equal to y will be equal to 10 minus 2 beta by 5 that is the ordinate that is the ordinate because it lies on L1 agreed now we use uh, the given fact that this P divides the line segment AB in the ratio 1 is to 2 so P with the coordinates 2 comma 3 divides the line segment AB internally in the ratio 1 is to 3. 1 is to 3. Right. Now, we use the section formula. Section formula. So, write the x coordinate of the P. The x coordinate of the P is 2, I know. But uh, by the section formula, it will be 1 times beta plus 3 times alpha by alpha plus beta is equal to 2. This is 2. And the ordinate is 3. How? 1 times the ordinate of the 1 times the y coordinate of B. Y coordinate of B is this. Plus 3 times the y coordinate of A. 3 times the y coordinate is this by 1 plus 3 is equal to 3 simplifying 1 plus 3 is 4 4 twos are 8 and this will imply 3 alpha plus beta is equal to 8 and 1 plus 3 is 4 4 threes are 12 we have sent this is the 12 and here in the numerator we have taken the LCM we have taken the LCM the LCM is 15 and uh, 3 times 10 minus 2 beta plus 15 times 12 plus 4 alpha by 15 is equal to 12. We further simplify. The first equation is as it is 3 alpha plus beta and the second one is simplified 15 12 or 180 and further simplification we have done it and that will get 10 alpha minus beta is equal to minus 5. Two equations, two unknowns and we know how to solve it. And we solve for alpha for alpha and beta. And we get alpha is equal to 3 by 13 and beta is equal to 95 by 13. So, two equations, two unknowns. We know the methods. So, alpha, beta values, we got it. Right. Let us get into A. Put the value of alpha. Then we will get the coordinates of A. So, A. The coordinates are alpha comma 12 plus 4 alpha by 3 substitute for alpha 3 by 13 and this will be a 3 by 13 and when simplified this part will come out as 56 by 13 and b that in that beta value is substitute beta is equal to 95 by 13 and in this also 10 minus 2 beta by 5 
for beta 95 by 13 you substitute and simplify you will get minus 12 by 13 agreed thus we got uh, the coordinates of uh, the triangle a b c so the vertices that means the coordinates of the vertices of the triangle are known and now it is easy to find the area of the triangle agreed we have a the coordinates are here 3 by 13 comma 56 by 13 the vertex b the coordinates are 95 by 13 comma minus 12 by 13 c the coordinates are minus 15 by 13 and 32 by 13 and uh, the area of uh, the triangle ABC is mod absolute value of 1 by 2 into the determinant x1, y1, 1. So this is x1, y1, x2, y2, x3, y3. So 3 by 13, 56 by 13, 1, x2, y2, 1, that is 95 by 13 minus 12 by 13, 1, third row will be x3 y3 1 minus 15 by 13 32 by 13 1 now from the first column 1 by 13 is common you take out and uh, from the second column 1 by 13 is common you take out so it comes out modulus absolute value of 1 by 2 into 1 by 13 that of the first column into 1 by 13 that of the second column then multiplied by the determinant 3 56 1 95 minus 12 1 minus 15 32 1 now expand this determinant by the first column by the first column now 1 by 2 into 13 into 13 into modulus of 3 into minus 12 minus 32 and uh, by first column we are expanding minus 95 into 56 minus 32 minus 15 into 56 plus 12 plus 12 so simplify that will be 1 by 2 into 13 into 13 modulus of this is minus 132 this is after multiplication minus 2280 minus 1020 in the absolute value and when you add this this will be minus 3432 3432 when added and the modulus of minus 3432 is 3432 by 2 into 13 into 13 and after simplification you will get 132 by 13 that is the area of the triangle ABC and that is what is required to find so let's look at our options our answer appears against option B therefore the answer for this question is option B and that is the detailed discussion of the solution of the problem from the coordinate geometry which is based which is based on the concepts of straight lines and uh, my impression about uh, this question is this will be definitely a difficult question to get the answer in the examination hall why because it is tedious because because uh, solving equations are there and computations are there so it will be difficult in the examination this is my impression about it however once in a while such questions do come do come and uh, i am sure that you have understood the solution of this problem and i wish you all the best thank you